as you can see I'm annoyed by that but that shouldn't have happened it shouldn't have been that I mean we deployed more or less the same we lost more or less the same and I actually killed more so you can kind of tell from that that I should have probably won this battle I even def took out the general from the fleet first so I should have had a morale debuff but for some reason for some reason I didn't win that at all uh, close defeat oh look at this the general's still alive most of this is alive all of that's gone most of the, are they even going the, ugh, all I can say is ugh. <laughs> making sexual noises now another elephant please that was irritating right Garduba's finest Oh my god, look at this. Six, fifteen, nine. Let's put them into. They gotta attack me from. From the fort, haven't they? The path they're gonna hit me from is there. So we're gonna go there. And I can actually change to fortify. I think that's a good idea. So we'll try fortify from the there, look. Yeah, and they'll be in my radius when they get to there, so they can only come from that right that way. So that's that's good. I think. <laughs> um, I I can I can't recruit bugger all. Any mercenaries? Any mercenaries? Oh, I can actually have some mercenary cav, which will be handy when I take Migdol eventually. That is the plan. They got no navy there now as well, so I should be able to take Migdol. Props probably next turn, but I'm probably going to lose Tingus to the Maasai Ely tribe. Uh, I think I can probably, yeah, that's good. They can only come from this path, so they're going to have to fight me there. I'm not sure whether this reduces some of their reinforcements, but I'm hoping this it will. We'll end turn. Uh, the mistake I made in that last battle probably was that I that I didn't actually deploy into Hopate formation in the old phalanx. If I had gone into phalanx or spear wall, whatever it is, then I probably would have... Ooh, what's this? Ah, oh, fucking hell, man. This is not fair. Right. For some reason, they've killed war me as well. The Keltiki. I've got nothing to take out the Keltiki. We want Migdol. I should have done a different campaign. <laughs> oh, no. The good thing is that only one army is attacking me. The bad news is they've got 2,000. And they got all this bullshit Africa, uh, Namibian spearmen. Right, we're going to attack them. Because I'm fortified anyway. Uh, they outnumber me. I do have war elephants though, so that should give me the edge. I kind of have an idea in my head already. I'm going to have the elephants outside the deployment zone. They're going to attack from the outside and weaken them try and take out their javelin men the spearmen should be able to be dealt with with my Libyan hot let's have a look I do have deployables as well so I don't know which way the enemy is going to come from do they tell me on here? no at least if I block them let's see what we got what's this? spikes just gonna look what we got. We got these palace walls, are they something? Barricades. Like that. That kind of blocks them. I don't want them coming in from this side at all, do I? I'm gonna put actually put this here then. Like so. That's not too bad. What can we have it like? Come on, pathfinding, don't play up. No, don't not like that. Oh, wait. That's better. That kind of stops them there. We want to do the same this side. So we'll have a barricade to this gate like so. And then we'll pick the next one of these. We'll do the same thing. Stretch it out. I might actually Yeah, better like that. I'm gonna do it with this side as well. Stretch out a little bit more, perhaps. Yeah, that's better. One, we got one left. Brimstone pits. 
Maybe those little they the those things. I could put that. What's a brimstone pit do? Fire pits. Ah, that's right. You can set them on fire. That'd be good probably. If I can do it. Put them in the front but there. Right, deployment. I want my elephants outside. We'll start off at the back by here. We can go in any direction then with them. I'm gonna put kind of want them to come in by here, don't we? So, actually I'm going to put one of them to me being a daredevil, I'm going to put one of them like that into phalanx. I'll put this one oh, out into phalanx. I'm going to put a third one into phalanx behind as a secondary line. Like that. Get one on the gate here into phalanx. Another one onto the gate by here. And then of course I can pull them back then if I need to and go to the front of the gates. I have two more in reserve which can go as a secondary line behind them. Then these guys can be grouped up. What's the range on them? They can hit them from out here. That's good. Uh, bring them about there. I think that is pretty much it. So we'll put them on to quick reload straight away. Where's the enemy coming from? To the right over this shit. So this is a waste all this was. <laughs> you know what? It's not a waste. We will do well here. This phalanx is going to come out to here. This phalanx is going to cover the gap there. We're going to blob in. Blob in all these. I'm going to keep these out. He, he can block the gate. This one can block the gate that side. This one can stay in the gap for now. Javelin men! They can all come there. This is going to be a bit risky, this is, but it always is with me. Spearmen. Oh, they're leaving, they're leaving all the javelinmen behind. Seriously. What the fuck? I can't really attack them with my elephant. I'm going to bring my, well, my elephant right up to the right flank in that case and start taking them out from there. Javelin men! The blob should hold. They can't really come in through the barricades there. Oh, can they actually smash barricades? They can, can they? Shit, I just remembered they can actually smash barricades down. Send this unit up then to help. <laughs> this is going to be an untidy mess. But it should work. My elephant's gone past them, that's good. Missiles will start firing. They haven't got any missiles with them, have they? It's all spearmen. All the spearmen bullshit this is. Complete spearmen bullshit. Just gonna blob the exit as much as I can. There we go, spearmen are firing, that's good. War elephants. We're gonna go right up to this flight flank up here. Oh, they shit, they charging me. Right. Let's go straight for the javelin men with the elephants. We'll have stampede on once we get close to them and we'll start taking them up with the elephants. Uh, this unit can, can, can come around. Balhamun, be praised. Right, we'll put. Stampede on. Go fucking nuts on these. I could have gone for the general actually. Ah, I believe it. The javelin will have him. I hope. Look at this bullshit. Just spamming their way through. Ah, oh, piss off advice. Must remember to turn the advice off. Is this guy gonna charge me with with Numidian uh, cavalry? I hope so. We're gonna stick second window. Oh my god. Oh, it's happened again. This is bullshit. I can't actually attack with the war elephants again. Well, patch 9 completely bollocks up elephants. That kind of bollocks up my campaign a bit. Oh, fuck on button. That's what I wanted. I've only killed 65. Just hopefully they'll take man many of them out. Epically. Oh my god. They're wavering. Some of them are wavering. Stupid war elephants. I only lost two of them mine, it's not bad. Nope, wrong button. 
I just moved somebody then. Who did I move? Shit, I can't remember who I moved. Don't know. It's all good. It's all good in the hood. The longer they stay there, the more much javelins I can actually get on them. Put the second wind. Can I actually? I can actually second wind myself, even though I can't control them anymore. But look at this! It's stupid. They just out of control straight away. Stupid, stupid, stupid. What? They've been attacked. Oh come on! We should be able to take cavalry out. We're spearmen for Christ's sake. Oh, I don't tell me they're out in. Oh my God. Bullshit! 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 Alert! Bullshit! Alert! Cavalry versus spearmen. Cavalry wins. Weird. 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 Right, we're gonna keep these guys here. I may actually ignite these if, if I think I need to. Oh no, they've ru they've routed in from here now as well. Look at this bullshit. They've, they've broken in. I got no spearmen left. Fucking charge! Wild elephants, bloody crap. Useless pieces of shit. That's all I can say. Let's fucking charge them with this unit as well. As you say. Javelin man! Fucking shit! Oh, I have control of the elephants again. That took a while. Charge them, you fucking retards. Stupid! Can the elephants save the day? Take out the general and actually save me. Just charge everything in. Where are you running away from, you fucking idiots? Oh, they've I oh, don't need my control anymore. Oh, they're gone. Right. Bird flying around the screen. Very authentic. Whatever. Kill the general. If I can kill the general at least, then that might give me something in this battle. Somehow I've got the advantage on the on the thingy bar. Second wind myself. That's right, elephants. Just charge them in the rear. <laughs> Fucking kill them all. Oh elephants, fucking kill them. That's right, charge into the into their rear. Charge them into their rear. Into their bodies. Oh my god, this is like <laughs> I've lost like most of my units, yet the elephants are gonna win this for me now. Maybe they're not completely bullshit after all. Where why are you guys running for, you fucking retards? Get back. Right, we've, we've attacked the Slingers and I think we've won this. Somehow. God knows how I've won this one. I got one unit of war elephants left. How many kills? 525 kills. 60, 89, 207. 61. There we go. End battle. Costly victory. I've actually got a Steam achievement here, but it's not loaded up on the screen for some reason. Don't tell me this... this uh, this game's crashed on me now because it'd be kind of disappointing if it has. Furic victory. Don't even know what Steam achievement was, but it, there we are. Ah, <laughs> oh, this is bullshit. Furic victory. We're gonna fucking kill them all. Kill them all. Malamun be praised. Kill them all. No, that's right. You fucking retreat back to your own border, you plebs. That was quite good. Nice to have a victory. Sards. Syracuse. Look at the Etruscans, Jesus. They've taken Neapolis. And they've taken Rome. Is, is Rome... Right, hang on, look at this second. Carthage is... Do nothing. Fuck, I hate this political game. Bullshit, anyway. Uh, let's go over here. Caradis. Syracuse has taken... <laughs> look at it. They have Brundisium and they have Velathri, and that's all Rome has. Don't have Rome anymore. Well done, Etruscan League. Hopefully, we'll become a DLC at some stage because I wouldn't mind playing as the Etruscans. I have had a go at them with one of the mods, and they're pretty cool. I'd like to see them a bit more fleshed out, though. Uh, I think we can attack Migdol. We must take Migdol. Migdol. Attack them there. Get this geezer to Migdol. Oh my god, right. 878 plus 313, so over 1000. Oh my god, where did they go? With a, uh, a circle in there. Encircle them. And I'm gonna stay here with this army. We're not actually re replenishing, which is a bit of a shame. We can have 
Komodo. Invade in. Critical success. Go with authority. And I think I'm going to end my recording session there. So I hope you've enjoyed these episodes of the Carthage campaign. I've been Dragonheart. Until next time, goodbye.